Hello and welcome to Hey Guess What? In many of our videos, we teach you about interesting things that may have happened a long time ago, as well as facts about animals, people, holidays, and more. But in today's video, we want to teach you about something very important that we think you should know as much as you can about so you can help keep yourself safe and healthy. Today, we are going to learn about the coronavirus, what it is, and how you can help prevent you, your friends, and family from possibly getting it. At the time of creating this video, at least 41 people have died from a new coronavirus in China following an outbreak in the central city of Wuhan, forcing the government to lock down over a dozen cities with a population of 56 million people. The coronavirus, which is in the same family as SARS and MRSA, and can be transmitted between person to person, the country's health ministry has confirmed. A coronavirus is a type of virus. As a group, coronaviruses are common across the world. The most common symptoms of coronavirus include fever and a cough, but they can progress to severe pneumonia, which can cause shortness of breath as well as breathing difficulties. In severe cases, it can also lead to severe acute respiratory syndrome, kidney failure, and even sometimes death. Generally, a coronavirus can cause more severe symptoms in people with already weakened immune systems, older people, as well as people with long-term conditions like diabetes, cancer, as well as chronic lung diseases. Wuhan novel coronavirus is the new strain of coronavirus first identified in Wuhan City, China that has been talked about all over the news lately. The incubation period of the coronavirus remains unknown, but some sources say it can take between a week and a half to two weeks. So where did the virus originate? Well, Chinese health authorities are still trying to establish the origin of the virus, which they believe came from a seafood market in Wuhan where wildlife was also traded illegally. The WHO, or the World Health Organization, also says an animal source appears most likely to be the primary source of the outbreak. Snakes. Snakes, including the Chinese crate and the cobra, very well could be the source of the newly discovered virus, according to Chinese scientists. So coronaviruses infect the upper respiratory and gastrointestinal tracts of mammals and birds, and six different strains of coronaviruses infect humans. Coronaviruses are believed to cause many common colds in human adults. The significance and the economic impact of coronaviruses, though, is hard to figure out. Unlike rhinoviruses, which is the common cold virus, the human coronaviruses are very difficult to grow as well as study in laboratories. The symptoms of most coronaviruses are very similar to those of the common cold, including sneezing, stuffy or runny nose, a sore throat, coughing, watery eyes, mild headache, and sometimes mild body aches. So how can we prevent getting the coronavirus? The best way to prevent infection is by taking simple precautions that can be used for many infectious diseases. So doing things like washing your hands with soap and water many times throughout the day or using hand sanitizers regularly will help. Also, try not to touch your nose, your eyes, or even your mouth if you haven't washed your hands in a while. And also, tell others to cover their nose and mouth with tissues when coughing or sneezing. This is how the coronaviruses can spread. Coronaviruses, including SARS, COV, are spread by close person-to-person -person contact, most commonly during the winter cold months. The virus is usually spread by respiratory droplets that happen when somebody infected coughs or sneezes. The droplets containing the virus can be launched into the air from a sneeze or cough up to about three feet away and can land onto people's hands, in their mouth, nose, or eyes of people nearby. The droplets can also land on books, toys, magazines, as well as surfaces where someone can pick them up and then touch their mouth, their nose, or their eyes. So what is the virus causing illnesses in Wuhan? It is a novel coronavirus 
That means a member of the coronavirus family that has never been seen before. Like other coronaviruses, it has come from animals. Many of those infected either worked or frequently shopped at the Hunan Seafood Wholesale Market in the middle of the Wuhan city, which also sold live and newly slaughtered animals. A recent genetic study tells us that the virus looks like other viruses that can infect bats as well as snakes, and the people researching think that it may have resulted from separate viruses in bats and snakes combining multiple times over and over. And this could have happened in the wild, but may also have happened in the seafood market where the animals have been kept close to each other during that time. So as you can see, there are many different things you can do to prevent yourself from getting the coronavirus, as well as even common cold viruses. So make sure you're always washing your hands or using hand sanitizer and keeping yourself clean. Also, make sure to cover your mouth as well as use a tissue if you have to wipe your nose or maybe even cough into. We are also going to include some links in the description below where you can find more information about the coronavirus and how you can help prevent it in yourself, your friends, as well as your family. So thank you so much for watching. We will see you on the next Hey Guess What? And if you haven't subscribed, make sure you click that subscribe button and we'll see you on the next Hey Guess What? Bye.